it takes so long to find every swear word in a video and then to add the sensor beep sound on top of every swear word to hide each one. I hate doing it manually when editing. But it's also really important that you censor bleep out any of your video's curse words. And I'll tell you why. First, videos on YouTube can get demonetized if they have swearing in the first 30 seconds. And secondly, viewers might just switch off your video early if they don't like the cussing in it, which is going to limit how many new people your video is promoted to in the future. So you've seen the title to this video. You already know that there's now an AI app that bleeps out swear words in videos automatically. That app is called Opus Clip. They're who I'm making this video for today. So to break this video down, I'll start with a quick tutorial on how to automatically bleep out curse words in videos. Then I'll show you how to get a free trial to Opus Clip so you can start trying the app out yourself for free. Let's jump right into it. How to automatically bleep out curse words from your videos using Opus Clip. Here's the screen you'll see when you are set up and logged into an Opus Clip account. And this is the starting page where you connect Opus Clip to your video. You can do that by either dropping in a link to your video here. The link can be to Facebook, LinkedIn, YouTube, or any other popular video site. Or you can use this button down here to upload your video directly from your computer. Oh yeah, and you can also connect your Google Drive and pick a video from your Google Drive account with this button. But I'm going to upload a video this time by clicking this box. Once Opus Clip has access to your video, you'll see this next page here, which is just kind of like the next stage we need to go through to get to the censoring. So we just need to set a few things here. First, click on this drop down for speech language and just make sure the correct language that your video is in is selected. Then scroll down and press don't clip. This basically tells Opus Clip that we want our whole video to be checked for swear words and we don't want any of it ignored. Then you scroll down and pick your template. There's a ton of short form templates. So if you've uploaded like a short form video and you want captions automatically added to your clip, you can just choose the caption style here. My video is actually a horizontal video with no captions. So I've selected this template that I've already set up, horizontal template with no captions. If you don't already have your ideal template set up, don't worry, just choose one of the preset templates here. You can always change settings at the next area. Great, and I'm going to just scroll up now and press this button here, get clips in one clip to have Opus Clip analyze my video and to go to the next screen where we can censor the curse words. So let's press that now. Great, this is the next screen where you'll see a preview here of the video that you uploaded. We can preview the video by pressing this play button here, but I'm actually going to go straight into the editor by pressing this edit clip button, which is where we're going to be able to automatically add that sensor beep sound. So we'll press edit clip now. And this screen is the Opus Clip editor where we automatically add that beep sound onto our swear words. We have a preview of the video here. We have the standard timeline view down here, just like in normal video editors where you can scroll through the video. And most importantly, we have everything that is said in the video converted into text, which we can easily see on the left-hand side here. And if you look closely, you'll see a few swear words in there, which we are going to get Opus Clip to automatically censor now. So to bleep out those cuss words, we just need to go to AI Enhance on the left here. We're going to press the new auto censor feature down here, which as you can see, it censors curse words for us. So we'll press that. You'll see the default setting is to censor curse words by adding the bleep censored sound. So we're going to leave that by default and press this enable auto censor button to automatically add those bleep sounds to our swear words. So I'll press that now. We can see at the top an announcement that it's centered all four of the swear words that are found in this clip. And if we look over here on the transcript, we can see that each of those four swear words, there's one, there's one, there's one, and there's one. They've all been censored because they now have those three asterisks written on top of where the swear words were originally written out. So now we've told Opus Clip to automatically apply that bleep censorship sounds whenever it finds a swear word in our video. If we play this video at any point, whenever we reach a swear word, we'll hear that bleep. So we'll give that a try now. So let's hop to this point in the video by clicking this word here and we'll just press play. You'll feel like and 
when social media platforms like YouTube decide to demonetize you. There we go. So this auto centering feature in OpenStip is new. It's not always perfect. It's still being improved, but the amount of potential for time saving of just automatically being able to censor curse words, that's going to save so much time in the long run over manually doing this yourself. And when this tool is perfected, I can see people using it all the time. Let us know what you think to this tool, if you think it's useful or not. Also, if you've got any other ideas for features you'd like to see in OpenStip, let us know in the comments. And yeah, you can start using OpenStip on a free trial by just clicking the link in the description to this video. The auto sensor feature is on the paid plan, I believe. So you'll probably have to upgrade to use this, but you can check out a ton of the other OpenScript features on the free plan, which are ran through in this video from Dan. And in that video, he also tells you how to set up those templates that I talked about earlier. So check out the free trial, watch this tutorial from Dan and check out the bleep feature when you get the chance to and let us know what you think. Cool. Bye.